Planet Dolan. From geniuses trying to predict the future to the real reason the dinosaurs went extinct, we look at 10 crazy theories that people actually believed. Number 10. Pythagoras' Theory If you remember much of anything from your time with math at school, you probably remember that A squared plus B squared equals C squared, which is correct. But Pythagoras also believed that you could write on the moon with mirrors and human blood. But that's not all that Pythagoras believed in. He had an entire cult that employed crazy ideas, such as peeing in relation to the sun, beans being the source of evil, and that there are no numbers that have digits that go on forever. Number 9. Using magnets to explain why gay marriage is wrong. In 2013, a grad student from Nigeria used magnets to disprove gay marriage as a valid ceremony. And no, he was not working from his basement. He actually got full funding from the university to do this research. Basically, it works like this. Opposite poles of magnets attract one another, and like-sided poles repel. Therefore, gay people are bad or something. Obviously, there was no flawed logic in this gem of study. Mm -hmm. Number 8. A Cold Sun The very same person that discovered the planet Uranus also believed that while the sun looks incredibly fucking hot from every which way you look at it, it is actually a giant cool planet-like entity, and the reason it looks hot is because of clouds. Now this is made even more insane by the fact that he even studied sunspots for a long time. I mean, he even correlated the appearance of sunspots with the rise and the fall of the wheat market, which has not been disproven yet but it is considered to be highly unlikely. Number seven, turtles all the way down. Craziness is not restricted to the scientific community. Various communities all over the world, including China, America, and even India, believe that the world is flat and that it's on the back of a giant turtle. Although very few people literally believe this theory in the Hindu faith, it is often used in philosophical arguments in which the popular phrase, it's turtles all the way down, appears frequently when somebody asks what the turtle is on. Number 6. Tectonic Strain Okay, so back to the crazy people that are funded by universities. A professor of neuroscience believed that tectonic shifts actually caused electromagnetic fields, light, you know, that caused hallucinations in humankind. This was his answer as to why so many people believe that UFOs, ghosts, or any number of paranormal entities even exist. Now, this is not held as a highly valid theory today, as tectonic shifts tend not to cause all that much light, and very little of it is unique. And also... Light causing your brain to hallucinate? That's ridiculous. Number 5. Caterpillars killed the dinosaurs. An asteroid killing the dinosaurs is one of the many theories on how the dinosaurs disappeared. And although it is considered by most to be correct, a scientist in 1962 believed that it was actually the caterpillars that killed them off. Unfortunately, this is not as batshit insane as it might sound, but it is pretty nutty. This guy believed that a certain species of caterpillar just exploded in population, and it ate most of the vegetation in the world. However, since his theory, we have proven that these caterpillars and the dinosaurs lived together for millions of years, and that a big enough population of caterpillars to hold up this theory was never reached. Number four, time cube. So the Earth has four distinct parts of the day. You have sunrise, day, sunset, and nighttime. Pretty simple and explainable by astronomy. But that was not good enough for Gene Ray, who proposed that there are four separate days happening at once. 
This theory is known as the Time Cube, and Gene Ray was so sure that he was right that he bet some MIT scientists $10,000 to see if anybody could disprove it. But none of them bothered. Number 3. Homeopathy In the 18th century, the idea that water had memory was a popular one. Not just the remnants of what had been in it, though, but actual physical memory, as they believed that if you take a substance and dilute it down to the point where not a single molecule of the substance is left, the water will still remember the substance and will have medical properties because of it. Strangely enough, this belief is still around, and it's mostly popular in Europe and the UK, to the point where their healthcare actually covers it. Number 2. Alchemy The precursor to chemistry was alchemy, yet alchemy was so crazy that it would be better to call it an attempted type of magic than any sort of science, as alchemy was based off this strange idea that gold was the most pure of all the elements, and that everything else could be reduced down to this cleaner state. And it wasn't that long ago that this was popular either. Isaac Newton wrote more papers on alchemy than he did on physics or mathematics. Number 1. The Hollow Earth Theory It's pretty obvious to you and I that when we look up at the sky at night, we see out of the earth. But according to John Sims, we have it all backwards. John Sims came up with the Hollow Earth Theory where we all live on the inside of the crust of a giant sphere and that outer space is actually inner space in that we wrap around the entirety of the cosmos that we look out into. Now while this might seem like a bit of uneducated pondering, it's actually a theory that people take seriously even to this day, even though they really, really shouldn't. Yeah. All right, guys. So what is the dumbest thing that you believed in when you were a little kid? Let us know in the Reddit page linked below, and you might be featured in a future countdown. <laughs> See ya! Ever played The Sims and forgot to get the little guy to the bathroom in time and they pee themselves? Well, that's explained now. Fire in the kitchen? They just didn't level your skills in cooking. Feel like you have no control over your life? You don't!